Good morning, hey y'all. Welcome to another video. It's me, Simply Tanya Renee, and I am preparing for um, my first public event in years to speak on nutrition. Hopefully, I can get someone to record it for me um, because like I said, it's been years since I've done this. But um, years ago, I went through NASM and got a personal training certification um, and partially nutrition. I never finished the whole nutrition segment, but that is something that I realized has just been laying dormant. Um, it wasn't until I was asked to speak to the girls, they are teenagers, um, it wasn't until I was asked to speak to them until I realized I really did enjoy doing that. So oh, I am nervous, um, and like I said, I'm going to try to get it recorded. If not, then y'all are definitely, you know, I'm going to talk to y'all later on today while I'm making those pies, but y'all, say a prayer for me. I know it's going to be over by the time y'all see this. So what I'm doing now is just hurrying and getting dressed. My hair tie, the first one popped off, so I just went with a black one. So I'm just going to get dressed real quick. Well, I'm dressed already, and y'all can't really see what I'm wearing try to show you that later. This is a um, LuLaRoe, 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 Lula, 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 not LuLaMond, Y'all know what it is, but this is one of their, their robes. And I wear it as a um, show cover up, or sometimes I just wear it as like a, um, what is this thing called? cardigan style and I have like a little patent leather black belt on. I'll try to show y'all later. My Stassi Jones jewelry. I put on my watch and my rings and stuff. I'm ready to do my face real quick because I need to be out of here and get there by 12.15. So just wanted to tell y'all what's up and I will be hopefully getting it recorded and talk to y'all later. Alright y'all so I made it to the location I think. They normally wear um, shirts to their meetings. Okay, yeah, I see a lot of girls pulling up now with their parents um, getting dropped off. I'm gonna make sure I'm at the right door because I want to make sure I go in the right door. <sighs> Lord be with me. Let this be a successful event. Give me the right words to say. Let it be engaging. And I thank you for this opportunity. And I thank you for opportunities to come. In Jesus' name, amen. I'm going to make sure that we are engaging with one another and just, you know, having like a little chit chat, not so much a lesson, but just, you know, talking to one another and answering some questions and talking about food and all that good stuff. So today we are talking about nutrition and I need my glasses. So if I take them off and put them on, it's because I can't see y'all with them on, but I can see my iPad. <laughs> So what do we know about nutrition? What do you think nutrition actually is? Anyone? Okay, what's your name? Destiny. Destiny, what do you think nutrition is? Okay, good eating, absolutely. So according to the Health, Health Administration, nutrition is the process of food that we eat and it turns into energy and other nutrients that our bodies need. So some of the nutrients that our bodies need are protein, which is like your chicken, your turkey, your meats, your, your um, like beans and lentils and things, fats, carbohydrates, vitamins, water, and minerals. How many of y'all drink water on a regular basis? Oh, that's awesome. I'm so glad to hear that because I see so many people not drinking water, so that is actually very important. And water is gonna be one of the things that sustains us. All right, so let's talk about uh, one thing that people talk about, carbohydrates. Has anyone heard about carbohydrates before? What is something that people normally say to the adults about carbohydrates? What do they normally tell us? Low carbs. You don't eat too many, and what else? Low carbs. Lower your carbs. So let me tell you, carbohydrates are actually really good for us. We should make sure that we're eating good carbs, like anybody like sweet potatoes, like candy yams and stuff like that. 
So yams are good for us. We just got to cut down on the amount of sugar that we put in them. But I do like a little bit of brown sugar and a little bit of other sugar in my yams too. Um, another good thing that's a carb heavy in carbohydrates is bananas, um, quinoa. I know a lot of people don't like quinoa because of the texture of it. But quinoa is a really good food that you can prepare. And what you can do with that, you can actually cook that to take on the flavors of something that you like. It's kind of like tofu, which is also considered a protein. So if you take quinoa, it's like little pellets that you'll find in the grocery store. They come in a bag. And you can season it if you like, say, that you want something teriyaki flavored. You can actually season that with teriyaki seasonings and you're getting a healthy meal and you're getting a good carbohydrate and also a protein in one item that you're putting on your plate. Does that make sense? Yes, no? <laughs> I know it's kind of early, it was almost one o'clock, it's still kind of early on Saturday. <laughs> All right, another thing that we can eat for proteins, who likes beets? Mm -hmm. Not too many people like beets. You like beets? Girl, me too. I love beets. I like them pickled and I like them regular. You can put beets on your salad and that will give you another good carbohydrate. Oranges are good for you. Berries and apples. Did y'all know that fruits could have carbohydrates in them? Did y'all know that? So carbs are really a good thing for us to have. We just have to have it all in moderation. And that's one thing I tell people. Nutrition is key and dieting is okay. But whatever you eat, make sure you just have it in moderation. Don't say that, tell people, don't eat that because you shouldn't be having that unless their doctor told them. I always tell people, eat what's going to be good for you and fuel your body. Just make sure you're doing it in moderation. Does that make sense, everybody? Mm -hmm. yeah. All right. So how many of you uh, like to drink those caffeinated drinks like the Monsters and what are some, the C4? Anybody drink those energy? Ooh, you drink them too? So listen, let me tell you all about those. So those drinks are loaded with sugar. I know a lot of us drink them, well, I don't drink them because they make my heart like jump out my chest. But I know a lot of people drink them because they want something to give them that jolt, something that's going to, you know, give them that energy that they need. And while they are loaded with caffeine, they actually are going to take down on your nutrition levels in your body. That, and they do that by lowering the amount of sleep that you're going to get. They can also begin to make you irritable. They can also bring on headaches. Uh, another thing I want to talk to you guys about is protein. Protein is a really good thing that we need in our diet. And I was once a pescatarian. I only ate like seafood and vegetables and things. But right now I'm a, become a flexitarian because I've started incorporating some meats back into my diet. We definitely need protein to sustain us as well. So can anyone give me any ideas of what you think proteins are other than the typical chicken, which is what everybody says? Okay, y'all, it's over, I survived. And the girls were very engaging. The mentors were engaging. <sighs> Thank you, Lord, for a successful chat. Cause it was more so like a fireside chat. Ooh, a fireside chat. I like the way that sounds. All right, I'm back home. It's a lot going on. The TV is on. It's the Auburn Georgia game. The air fryer is going. So if it's loud in here, sorry. So I'm probably just going to end up just monetize, monetizing this out. You know, recording with no sound and put some music on the back. So you ready to make the soup. This is the leeks. Um, I have about six potatoes. I'm trying to get those up for y'all. Six potatoes. Um, two. These onions, and then this is just a just in case I need an extra onion. Some garlic. These two carrots, and can you give me two more carrots? Maybe. I think I'm gonna see if we got. I might need like one or two more carrots. How big are the ones that we have? Yeah, some of the ones that some are Is that water in the bag? Ooh, trash. These two carrots, because the tr carrots didn't really go in the trash, the ones that were in the refrigerator, because they went bad. Mm, no. Okay. I'm just going to use these. We got chicken broth. I'm going to put in some, uh, once it starts to cook and everything, I'll be adding some cornstarch to thicken it, and um, some milk, and all the little seasonings. Hey, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna do it in the crock pot. Oh, my crock pot is broken. Oh, so I'm gonna use my good old faithful. This is the old faithful one. So I'm gonna go ahead and wash that and then get to cutting everything up for this 
delicious soup. Um, oh, let me show y'all the gift that I got. So, let me see. Is this everything? Yeah. So they gave me a journal, like I can take little notes and stuff. And this is this is the um, acronym for the girls club. I don't know if y'all can see it, but it says, girls influenced by righteous living in all situations. Then I have a lanyard and a nice, y'all know I love a good pen. And this is, um, child, I can't see all them words, but I know it's a girls pen. club. Um, oh, it might, yep, yeah, it's a stylus pen, yeah. Good eye. Good answer. Good answer. Wait. Good answer. Good answer. Um, a key ring. <laughs> and they gave me a thank you card. And the card says, thank you for speaking with our girls today about healthy eating. It's much appreciated. Love, Girls Club. So it was very, very rewarding. I enjoyed it. And I have talked long enough, so let me get started on cutting this stuff up. And um, yeah. y'all so everything is is basically the pies are done the um other than they just need to sit in the refrigerator for a while the soup is in a crock pot that's going to take a little bit longer for it to cook so i'll show y'all that tomorrow probably slice the pie tomorrow as well and have some of that but um other than that that was my day and i hope you enjoy hanging with me today and i will speak to y'all tomorrow my vibe tribe have a wonderful evening